and that will be your best way out. Mm. Mm. And that takes us directly to this uh, Montsil that? Yes. And how long is the drive, would you say? Under an hour. Uh, gee, the drinks are on the lawn at five. Oh, don't fuss, Geoffrey. That leaves plenty of time. I am not fussing. I need to go over my speech. I thought you went over it at the motel. Well, I want to get it word perfect. I do not want to make a fool of myself tonight, Suzanne. Thanks very much. How many drinks did you have on the plane? 29. It's automatic suspension of your licence for six months. Fabulous! I can stop driving you to your turgid school reunions. <laughs> Jesus, Suzanne, I'm going to have to do that lip again. Did you see that? There was a monkey. There was a monkey on the road. A monkey? I swear, it was a monkey, like that, like that feral little beast that attacked you in Thailand. I can't recall being stitched up in a third world hospital particularly funny. Oh, it was. There aren't any monkeys on eight lane highways, Suzanne. Just tragic women with alcoholic hallucinations. You're a 40 year old barrister dressed as a whore. Don't judge me, Geoffrey. It's a prostitute and pimp's party. What do you want me to go dressed as? Women are prostitutes. Men are pimps. Thanks for the social science update. It doesn't strike you as reasonable that at a prostitute's and pimp's party, I should go as a prostitute and you should go as a pimp. Would you go easy on that lipstick? It's $80 a pop. Christ, less is more, Jeffrey. Well, they say the same about Johnny Walker Blue, but that doesn't seem to hold you back, does it? <laughs> is that what you think being a woman is? Lipstick and fishnets and, and being ready to serve some pathetic male sexual fantasy? Some women do enjoy sex, Suzanne. I beg your pardon? Don't you dare make the wasteland of our sex life about me! I've straddled you in the study with my Brazilian wax and my leather bra and my vagina coated in honey, and all you said was that I'd ruin the Chesterfield! Perhaps if I'd strapped on a dildo and served you one up the ass, you wouldn't have cared. All right, shut up. Just concentrate on trying not to vomit on anyone tonight. Oh, and I hate to ruin any of the boy rocks. Oh, I said shut up, you sanctimonious bitch. I shut up! Because you're a drunk. And you're a poster. Yes, I am. I went down on Alexander Ryan in chambers three times and it was great. <laughs> Oh, fantastic. Now you've woken Amelia. I don't know why we couldn't have left her with my mother. Oh, wait. I said my wife insists on a blood test. Now Proctor versus the Crown showed irrefutably the deficiency of... Are you listening to me? Do you know who I am? My name is Jeffrey Blackson, and you... Oh, God, get your hands off me! I am a member of the bar. I know your boss. Oh, Suzanne, call my friend. Call every... Read everybody!